Stanford heads to USC. And look, USC is a 29-point home favorite here. Total is 70. 70. Uh, this is a 9.30 p.m. Central Time kick on Fox. Stanford, 2-8 and eight against the spread as a road dog since 2021. USC is 6-3 and three against the spread as a home favorite under Lincoln Riley. They like to cover some of these numbers. So, you look at the ESPN strength of record. You look at what USC, I mean, just ridiculous. Uh, Stanford's defense was not great at stopping the pass last week. Oh, the power numbers, I've got USC by 34. So, power ratings have them by 34. The raw statistical numbers have them by 44.31, which is just absurd. But a lot of that has to do with the, you know, the defense. Stanford's defense could not stop Hawaii, at least not from moving the ball. Uh, Stanford's defense, number 77 in PPA per pass allowed, number 67 in passing success rate, but Hawaii threw the ball 85% of the time last week. Uh, Part of that's because they were already down, right? Ashton Daniels, that quarterback for Stanford, fantastic. I mean, that kid was unreal. Three-star from the Southeast. I mean, he's... He looked great. Uh, USC on the other side, of course, that offense is going to look good. Number 10, PPA per pass. Number 16, PPA per rush. All the transfers that they brought in, all of them appear to have hit. Uh, Their offensive line looks pretty good. Number 27 in offensive line yards. They're not great in uh, stuff rate so far. Number 57, which Stanford might be able to take care of that. But Havoc rate allowed, number 31. Uh, Stanford couldn't create Havoc plays against Hawaii. I don't think they're going to do it here. So, USC... Uh, obviously, massive advantage on offense, and when you look at the de- or yeah, the USC defensive numbers, they're like they're not terrible, and the Stanford offensive numbers against Hawaii, they couldn't run the ball. They could throw it, obviously. Uh, number forty six PPA per pass, number twenty eight passing success rate, but they were number seventy six rushing success rate against Hawaii, and number eighty eight PPA per rush. USC can do that same thing. But I think USC is going to score a lot. So in this spot, like I, I think Troy Taylor wants to play fast. Of course, former FCS coach uh, at Sacramento State. I think he wants to play fast. You get into a shootout with USC, they're probably going to be able to cover. I'm going to regret this. I can already tell it. I can already tell that I'm going to regret the hell out of this. Um, give me USC to cover minus 29 here. I think there's just too many weapons here. I mean, I might be wrong. I don't know. My my power numbers like this and the raw stats like it. So give me USC minus 29. All right. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question, you can email me Gary at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button and we'll see you next time.